Previously on Zisto Plays Minecraft. And today we are going to begin a path where we haven't done anything yet. It's the only side where we haven't done anything. Today well, we're going to start with something very simple. We're just going to make a basic path through the landscape. What we're going to do, we are going to make a path. We're making a path. And so today we're going to start. We're going to start making a path here on, on this side over here. If you want to go from the Alpha Valley base right there. And you want to walk and enjoy the environment, you do it by following this night. nice, simple, straightforward path through the environment. Nothing complicated. Okay, some, like, a little bit of floating, a little floating island. And this. Oh, that's new. Yeah, that definitely, now that I get a little bit closer, that is definitely land. I see a whole lot of nothing. Oh my god! The ice! Run! Run! Close one! I almost fell through the... I almost... Wait. I almost fell through the air. Oh man, the storm. I think the storm is picking up. We've got some iron tools. That's pretty awesome. Sounds like the storm has died down a bit. I can't even hear it anymore. Whoa. Is it gone? Oh, I can see so far. Wow. Here we go. Oh my gosh, that was so close. Oh my gosh, we almost fell in. Oh, it seems like we jumped again. Welcome back, everybody, to Zisto Plays Minecraft. That's right, it is episode 92, and we are still lost out here in this weird environment of floating islands and other weird stuff. And I'm just trying to find my way back to the stuff we had built. I got totally disoriented, looking for lava for the Patch Museum. So, I don't know, we're just wandering around, basically. There is a little island there. That looks just like mine that I started with. I wonder if it has a chest. The chest on my island had lava in it, but I don't think it would load from this zone. I, you know what I do see, though? I see. If you notice, I see like a tiny little shadow right there. I think there might be a chest there. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to build a path. I think it's finished. Or it seems to have stopped anyway, at least for the time being. Doesn't seem like there's much left. There's me. I think I'm still here. And I'm just sort of floating in the middle of space or something. This big void. I feel different. I feel kind of weird. Like there's a... It's not really pain. There's a feeling... Where is it? Like, in my gut. And it's, uh... It's, like, right here. Apparently I picked up some clothes. I don't know where these clothes came from. What am I wearing? Overalls? Really? And a tank top. Okay. Well, whatever. Fine. Uh, I don't think that's the cause of the feeling. I'm wearing overalls and a tank top and pants for whatever reason. Maybe it's because it was cold. Maybe it's the wind. I don't know. But I've got a feeling, like, right here. Right about there. It's sort of an empty gnawing feeling, like... It's, it's very... makes me feel very uneasy. Am I hungry? I think I might be hungry! Hmm. Weird. I, you know, now that I think about it... Yeah, I think, I think it is hunger. Yeah. And now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever felt hungry before. Ever. And that, by itself, that's even weirder than feeling hungry, is that... I'm just realizing I've never felt hungry until this moment. 
Okay, but I don't have anything. I don't have any food. Oh, I'm standing on the ground. Oh. Okay, some, like, a little bit of floating... A little floating island is where we are. And there's nothing else. Just us. And by us, I mean me and the island. Me, the island, a tree, and this. Oh, that's new. Open. Close. Open. Close. Open. Oh, wait, hang on. There's melon. Oh, I bet I could eat that. Wait, hang on a second. Oh, no, wait. I don't think I should eat that. I'm really hungry, and that would solve my hunger, but I kind of think that might be a problem, because then we might not uh, have food left after that. All right, let's take a look at what we have here. We've got lava. That's not food. We've got string. That's not food. We've got ice. I can't eat ice. At least it would not be uh, terribly filling. Maybe it'd be filling, but not very uh, nutritious. No calories in ice, I don't think. There is mushrooms. Okay, we could make mushroom soup. That's food. Let's put that over there. Pumpkin seeds. That's not food. Cactus. Not food. Flowers. Not food. We've got some ingots. Gold ingot. Iron ingot. I can't eat that, and I cannot eat the stone. Can't eat the sugar canes. Even though it says sugar, it's technically... It's not very nutritious. All right, so we're not going to eat any of this stuff. What can we eat? Mushroom soup if we grow mushrooms. That's going to take a while. We've got the melon seeds, which we can make from the melon. I guess I'm going to have to grow that. That'll take a while. Oh, okay, hang on. I got an idea. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I got an idea. Ah, look, it's a bam Yeah, all right. So, uh, here's my, uh, here's my thought. Maybe we can get, and I think I just got one, we can get some seeds and we can grow some food. First things first, though, let's get this tree out of the way. Make sure we get the saplings, collect all the wood. All right, I got some wood, got some saplings. I got two kinds of saplings. That's kind of weird. Uh, okay, but one thing at a time. Well, I think our food is stabilized. Got some melons growing there. We got some wheat growing over here. I've got some melons on the bar. Let's pick up the wheat, replant the wheat. We can start working on something else. I think at this point, we probably need to start growing some trees because I am, whoa, we, did we just double our seeds? Holy cow, that's really good. That is really good. Because uh, normally you would get maybe plus one or plus two if you're really lucky. Doubling them is exceedingly lucky. We just went from four seeds to eight seeds, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I'm starting to run out of wood. So we need to, we need to start making a, we need to make a spot where they can grow and probably away from this fire. That seems like a bad idea, putting your tree next to where your lava is, probably gonna catch on fire if I was to guess. And now we can finally stop eating these stupid melons. As the old saying goes, sometimes bread is better. Well, I got the tree problem sorted out. We can make tools pretty much forever. I've got food. Although, it occurs to me, we could have even more types of food. We've got the melon, which stinks, and the bread, which is, well, it's okay. Sometimes bread is better, but even better than bread, uh, maybe we could fish for some fish. But I can't really make a fishing line without string, so I guess that means what? We need a mob farm. So, to make a mob farm, we're gonna need to build out a decent distance away from the base. So the mobs can spawn while we're doing other stuff in the base. Got some leaves. I think we'll build out with those because they don't, um, mobs can't spawn on the leaves. I've got an area down here. I've got little guardrails here and there, but most of the area is unprotected because if your base is not trying to kill you, you're doing something wrong. I guess I have to build downwards now. Okay, here we go. We gotta go a little bit lower and build out, make another platform, another floor, a basement, basement, sub-basement. Okay, 
Kill this guy, get him out of the way. There's a creeper. I don't think he's gonna blow up. Whoop, okay. Yeah, maybe the corners and the square pro- Oh, God. I decide ch <laughs> I changed my mind. Maybe this is a bad, maybe this is a bad layout. Uh, okay, might need some revision. I don't see any skeletons. Where's my bone meal? There was, oh, there must have been a skeleton over here because he shot at the creeper. Right. Okay, all right, uh, I think I'm going to, well, first thing I'm gonna do, I, let's close this off so that they can't walk down onto my path and then creep up on me later. This should be safe, we'll revise this. I might, uh, well, we'll think about it. Did I get, I got one bone, yeah, all right. So I can grow a few trees with that, that'll help. The leaf blocks have been really nice. We obviously have spiders over here. We made a spider farm by, well, I'll go show you the layout real quick. We can kill some of these guys. Hey, fellas, yeah, that's right. There's some string. That's right, that's right, little spider fella. Oh, they're dropping little goopity globs, little orbs. You're dropping little orbs. Hey guys, ow, ow, what is that? Is this some like squishy bug juice? You like your blood? You got a green little gloopity. Oh, it filled up my little bar. Huh, okay, little gloopity globs from the spiders. And that fills up a little bar. Okay, maybe we'll find out what that does at some point. So anyway, I'll show you the layout really briefly. If we come up here. Yeah, and make sure we don't die. Actually, I think I can... Oop, they won't be able to get through the gap, so it's fine. Alright, so we got some little spawning platforms up here. We got some 3x3 three three platforms so the spiders can spawn. And then I used the shears to make some leaf blocks so that only the spiders would spawn. Because it's not tall enough for all the other stuff. And then we just have some water flowing around to push them down a shaft in the middle that's right there, basically. And that's the whole thing. Pretty simple, pretty standard. Not too complicated. Got pretty good amount of string. And that's good, that's what I wanted. Hey, you got some more gloopity globs. I heard... Oh, there you are, okay. Yeah, one more piece of string, a few gloopity globs. But I have got enough string. So what we can do now, it's, uh, that is what I wanted to do. We can... We can make a fishing line, yes, if a hook and line. And I'm going to need some sticks. One, two, three, four, five, blah, whatever. Just take all of them. Okay, crafting bench is right there. So we're going to a fishing line, and then we can do some fishing. We can get some better food. We can enjoy our life. So we need water if we're going to do some fishing. I've got these water streams I built to go down beneath the base and make basements and stuff. I think what we'll do is we will just fall down one of these guys. Try not to die. That's an important part. Here's the uh, the first basement I made where I scooped up the uh, remaining dirt from the underside of our starter island. But I think we'll just continue downwards and we'll make a an extra basement level and then we'll make a pool where all these guys can gather together and then we'll do some fishing there. It should be delightful. It should be a, a lovely time. I just gotta make sure I don't... F oh, God. Uh, okay, yeah. Be careful. Don't look down. Just uh, keep your eyes on the price. Is this far enough down? About right. Skadoosh, right there. And I'm gonna use leaf blocks, I think, for this one. Since I have so many, and they don't allow monsters to spawn, which also seems like a good idea. Alright, here we go. Look at this place. Doesn't this look cozy? Doesn't look like a comfortable place to spend your afternoon or morning or evening, whatever time it is here, I can never really tell. Just do a little bit of fishing. I think maybe with the downspouts, it might have to be in the middle if it goes out to the edge like that. Oh, I got a fish. Yeah, okay, already we got a fish. I suppose maybe if it's over there on the edge, it's okay. It's kind of touching the grass blocks, but I guess that doesn't matter. Bam! Okay, 16 raw fishies. I think maybe we need to redesign the fishing pond a little bit. Maybe make it a bit longer. There was some placement issues. I think if 
the, uh, the little bobber ends up out of the water or on the very edge. It doesn't count or something. I had to reset it quite a bit and like move my position, all that kind of stuff. But anyway, we got 16. That'll last a pretty good amount of time. We can cook these fellas up and then we will have a very balanced, nutritious, uh, very... Oops. Okay, put that, how about I put that away? A balanced, nutritious, variated diet with uh, some nice fish for our, for our stomach. There's a first one. Achievement get, yeah, cooked fish. Mmm, I'm not really hungry, but I'll go ahead and have it. What is that? What is that? That looks like land. How is there land there? It's like some kind of floating island. There's coal. We've got grass. There's a flower up there. Gravel. Oh, maybe we can find iron. Oh, maybe we can find a whole bunch of stuff that I just couldn't make. My little floating base. I thought we were all alone. Something just fell out of the air. A chicken. <laughs> Ooh-wee! Look at all the stuff! Alright, so it occurs to me we've got a number of different types of food. We got the wheat, we do have the watermelon, although I hope to never eat them again. I got some fish. What else could we get? Well, we could go try to get some animals, and then after we find the animals, we kill the animals. And hopefully they drop little nuggets of deliciousness. We can put the deliciousness in the furnace where I smelt metal. Which seems like that temperature would be a little bit too high. Yeah, I don't think that's the optimum cooking temperature for animal flesh or plant matter or anything else that you want to eat. I think it's just going to burn it. Pat, maybe we'll eat it raw. Okay, maybe we're going to eat the food raw. I did see... Yeah, you hear that? Yeah, I, I didn't see, but I heard... Heard a chicken. I wonder if he's up there. I've got like little mine mine tunnels dug everywhere. Where I've been looking for goods. I found some iron up here. Not a lot, but a little bit. Are you up here, chicken? I heard you, chicken. Okay, let's go see if the chicken is up here. Maybe we can find cows and pigs. Chicken. Chicken. Where are you, chicken? I don't see you. Man, it is really foggy out. Oh, the ice again. Chicken? The ice. I mean, the air. How did I get over here? Oh, no. It's happening again. Wait, it's happening again? What's happening again? Has this happened before? I feel like this has happened before. It happened again. Yeah, yeah. We definitely just jumped once again. I feel fuzzy, and then I'm somewhere else. It's like we were walking, and then we're here. And I heard some kind of sound. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, the storm, the storm is starting to go crazy. I am totally lost. I am, like, totally unbelievably lost. I can't see a thing. The storm is really picking up. I didn't bring a lot of supplies. I mean, I did bring... I brought tools and blocks and food, which I guess counts as supplies. What are we gonna do? Okay, I think... Oh, man. Holy cow. Storm. I think what we need to do is just hole up for a little bit. Okay, the storm's going crazy. It's picking up. Maybe if we just wait it out, it will calm down. Let's get some wood so I can make some more tools and make some torches and that kind of thing. Maybe we'll do a little bit of mining here, get some resources, make the most of our time while the storm's going crazy. All right, there we go. Maybe we'll get, oh, there we got a sapling good so we can replant these later. Yeah, we gotta go inside. We gotta go inside, like, right now. I got another sapling. I got a couple saplings. That's good enough. Okay, okay. We're gonna we're gonna dig into the wall right here. Make a little cozy home. Hole up for a little bit. And then hopefully the storm blows over. Well... 
Well, I managed to find a little bit of stuff overnight. Yum, 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 yum. There's the last of oh, the fish, and I'm pretty much out of wood as well. I still have the bread, I guess. Sometimes bread is better, but I prefer fish. Never did find any animals to murder. Found some other stuff. Is the... The fog is glowing pink. What is going on with the storm? Oh, you know what? Now that I think about it, I can't hear the storm at... Is that the sun? Holy cow. Holy cow! Skeletons. Whoa! Oh my gosh, I can see so far. That's a lot of nothing. Holy crap, what's over here? More skeleton? No, that's a zombie. Some creepers. Holy crap. Alright, let's get up here. Maybe I can see my base from up here. Still trying to get back to where we started. I went looking for food. I mean, for different types of food. A lot of monsters over there. Might have to shoot some arrows at them. Huh. Wow. Man, the sky is so clear. I can see so far. Here we go. Cross the ice. Here we go. Oh my gosh, that was so close. Oh my gosh, we almost fell in. Oh, it seems like we jumped again. And I'm just trying to find my way back to the stuff we had built. There is a little island there. That looks just like mine that I started with. We're gonna build a path. I think it's finished. Or it seems to have stopped anyway, at least for the time being. Doesn't seem like there's much left. There's me. I think I'm still here. And I'm just sort of floating in the middle of space or something. This big void. I feel different. I feel kind of weird. Like there's a... It's not really pain. There's a feeling... Where is it? Like, in my gut. And it's, uh, it's like right here. Apparently I picked up some clothes. I don't know where these clothes came from. What am I wearing? Overalls? Really? And a tank top. Okay. Well, whatever. Fine. Uh, I don't think that's the cause of the feeling. I'm wearing overalls and a tank top and pants for whatever reason. Maybe it's because it was cold. Maybe it's the wind. I don't know. But I've got a feeling, like, right here. Right about there. Oh, I'm standing on the ground. Oh. Okay, some, like, a little bit of floating, a little floating island is where we are, and there's nothing else. Just us. And by us, I mean me and the island. Me, the island, a tree, and this. Oh, that's new. Open. Close. Open. Close. Open. la 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 We got some wood, we got some saplings. Oh, that's better. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that hits the spot. Alright, tree situation, wood situation, check marks, big check marks there. Got some furnaces here, we're making some smooth stone, we're making some charcoal to make the smooth stone. Let's see, what do we have here? We got uh, 16s, so we'll put two in there like that, just good douche. Those guys are empty, that's all my solid wood. So we got some stuff here, I guess the next step, the next thing we'd want to do is uh, make a mob farm. We've got the food going, we've got the uh, the tree farm, we've pre preserved some grass, I made a bed, cobblestone generator, all the kind of stuff. Next thing to do, make a mob farm, right? Get the stuff we don't got that we can get. That's the, that's the idea. What can we do with these guys? I can make buckets, maybe we can make some bridges out of uh, iron railings, that'd be cool. 
Here, here's something we can make. I wonder what time it is. I have no idea. Kindly stop burning my crafting bench, please. Do clocks work in this universe? Oh, apparently they do. Or maybe it's just always the middle of the day. Or maybe I just happen to catch it at that time. I don't know. Okay, so put that away. Actually, yeah, for a second, let's put the saplings away. Give me a little bit of metal. Give me a little bit of that. That red juice. Look what we can make here. Let's see if I can remember. Uh, I think the, the metal goes in the middle. I always forget the order of those two. Because I think, um, I think the logic is that this is the push rod pushing the piston head. Oh, yes. Look at that. Technology. Look what we got. We can do all kinds of things with that kind of thing, can't we? Oh, yes. Hey. What was that? Well, anyway. Okay. So, what can we do? We can do this. Bam. That's right, Torch. Get wrecked. All right, well, a little bit of time has passed. I've built two different mob farms, and I stacked them up on top of each other. Since I have a little bit of redstone, I'm going to try to automate a little bit of this. I've only got 32 left. I made four different pistons, so I guess I had 36 to begin with. We can make levers all day, so we just have to figure out what we can do with what we got. We are about 20 blocks up, so it's going to take 10 of my redstone to invert some redstone torches to get up here to send a signal from down there. Otherwise, I'm going to have to, like, climb all the way up here every time I want to do something, which kind of defeats the purpose. We've got some water coming down here. Hopefully, we can spawn some enemies. There all the different mobs besides spoiters in this little chamber right here. And we'll let them uh, hang out here or whatever. Or, you know, I'll show up. I'll hit the redstone button to boo. And um, the water will push them into the middle. And then this will trigger... And the pistons will knock them down where I can. Well, they'll be uh, they'll be softened up, and I can just kill them with one hit. Hopefully, that's the idea. All right. So default state: pistons extended, no water. We show up. Uh oh, it's getting dark. Let's hurry up. I gotta go get to the bed. We reverse it. The water flows, pushes the monsters to the very middle where the pistons are retracted. We wait a few seconds. We click the button, or we reverse the signal again. And it hopefully pushes them into the shaft, and then we murder them. Yeah, we murder them. All right, so let's see if it works. Mobs up there. Let's set the water to motion. We got some squids. That's cool. We got some spiders here. That's pretty good. They're dropping lots of a lot of ink. What am I gonna do with all this ink, spiders? Hey, spiders. Hey, spiders. Ooh. Oh, they're dropping little orbies. Ooh. They're dropping little green goopity globs. Little green goopity globs. Okay, let's see if this works. Swip swap. Oh, ow! <laughs> I think it works. That surprised me. Okay, uh, maybe um, we can modify this little enclosure. This little, this little junction right there could be modified, but the system works, so that's fantastic. Whew! Oh, I got a little bar filling up. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that's working much better. Got quite a bit of string and a little bit of some other things. We can make some stuff with that. What can we make? I guess I can make some wool. I've got a little bit of dye here and there. We could make some, like, a, a tiny little painting with, uh, it would be fairly abstract because all I have to paint with is individual blocks of wool that would be dyed. Uh, but, I don't know. We don't have, like, a lot of options around here. I guess we could make, we can make fishing rods, we can make a bow, we can make a few things. Oh, look at that, I got seven arrows, look at that, holy cow, yush. What is that? Wow. It's like there's a big floating island of stuff out here. Look at all the stuff. It happened again. I was walking, and then, and then it was like, f I was fuzzy, or like I got electrocuted, or, oh man, I feel so weird. I was on a different, we were not here, we were somewhere else. Okay, now I have no idea where I am. Oh wow. 
It sounds like the storm is picking up. I didn't really bring much with me. We were just going out to look around. I think... Oh my gosh. Yeah, okay. We need to... Maybe we need to hole up for the night? <laughs> well, I ended up finding a pretty good amount of stuff. Some iron, some gold, and some coal. A lot of coal, a lot of monsters. Sounds like the storm is cleared up. Whoa! I can see so far! Here we go, cross the ice! Here we go! Oh my gosh, that was so close! Oh my gosh, we almost fell in. Oh, it seems like we jumped again. There is a little island there. We're gonna build a path. I think it's finished. Or it seems to have stopped anyway, at least for the time being. Doesn't seem like there's much left. There's me. I think I'm still here. And I'm just sort of floating in the middle of space or something. Apparently I picked up some clothes. I don't know where these clothes came from. What am I wearing? Overalls? Really? Oh, I'm standing on the ground. Oh. Okay, some, like a little bit of floating, a little floating island. Oh, look at that! Open. Close. Open. Close. Wow! Yeah, la 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 Well, that's a lot of wood. A lot of saplings. Let's make a cobblestone generator, I guess, is next. Look at all this! Pretty good, right? We got all the different things. We got the cobblestone generator. We got a farm making wheat. So I can have food, because food is good to have when you get hungry. I got all the trees growing. I've got a terraced ziggurat style kind of thing I'm developing here. And I'm working on some details. I don't have that many different block types available. But uh, from what we got, we're going to try to make some cool stuff. So working on this little detail with the stairs underneath. All the trees are growing. Holy cow. I think it's looking Ooh. pretty... What? Who are you? You have to get out of here. What? Why? He's coming. Who is? He'll find you. What do you mean? He'll... What do you... Did he just... Ooh. What the hell was that? Ooh. 